Yes, for the players out there, check out this dope shit, man. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're here with Shizzy. Yeah. He came through to Utah. I'd been seeing his stuff. I fucked with his vibe. I was like, yo, you should come lift. We're gonna go up a cup size today. I just will not be participating in the growth part of that, but definitely feeling natural. But you gotta push through, baby. Peep the berserk tea. You got it. With the chucks. Yeah, talk about it. What you rocking? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, on the, on the yeah. feet, my boy. We got, the, we got the high top horses. You know, we got the Nike sides, Young LA, Young, you know, Young LA up. Take the bandana out if it gets serious, but we're keeping this on standby for now. You already know. I feel like you got to be like of stature to rock Air Forces. Like you can't be skinny. <laughs> you literally look like a stick figure like, with Air Forces on. Right now, it would just look wrong. That's why I'm in skinny chucks. Maybe on the bulk, if I get big enough, I'll get some dunks and shit. <laughs> Rocking some forces. I'll get the black ones though. Ooh. Watch out, watch out for this man who he puts on black horses. I, you said you like the Smith machine, right? I do. Yeah, actually, we get yeah. to do Smith machine first. First exercise, I'll do anywhere from two to three warm ups. And then from that point on, I'll do no more than two warm ups. And then just one set. And I'll have a set rep scheme for every exercise. Compounds usually being six to eight. And then I'll go to like eight to 10 for more isolation stuff, like smaller rear delts, side delts. That'll be like eight to 10. Okay. So, uh -huh. Straight up to failure, six to eight reps on this bad boy. What's your all-time bench? 405. Shit! Mm. But that was like that was like peak bowl dude, like yeah. 250 pounds. What yeah. was my best? It was something around like 335 at a peak bowl. Dude, this bulk is gonna be crazy. Oh, your strength is you're gonna be shitting on those. I'm numbers. so I'm so hyped. Because yeah. I saw how you like blew up even more so after your yes. show. You literally chip. blow up. You're like you're chipping away your physique. You're getting to the base layer of your muscle, bro. Yeah. And you're building on top of that again. It's like you're perfecting your physique, dude. It's like great you. Yeah. It's beautiful. No. It was under all that fat. Motherfuckers didn't even know. Well, you fat motherfuckers, there's hope for you. you know? <laughs> if you fucking care about being strong, do not compete in a bodybuilding show, dog. No. <laughs> <laughs> my shit went from both my legs feel 50 pounds heavier. Bro, the separation on this dude's legs, for how far he is out right now, is actually nutty. Like, he's his own coach, bro. He told me he's his own coach. I got so mad at myself. But definitely, like, if you're wanting to compete, like, on whoever's watching this, and you're natural, and you want to see what it looks like and how to diet and stuff, bro, like, I'm not trying to gas him up, but, like, I literally have never seen a natural this condition before, so it's actually cra incredible. It's incredible. That's badass, thank you. We're just documenting it. There's definitely some yeah. natural bodybuilders that I follow and stuff yeah. that... A they lot just of don't just like to like keep it themselves though. Yeah, yeah, dude, it's just not popular. People want the easy way out. You can sit here and say people that are on gear still have to put in the same work, but you do get more benefit and it is a lot harder to go through that process, especially bodybuilding the process naturally. You don't have this other tool of your main hormone that yeah. you can put in your body and like kind of help you. It's all you your dude. drain mindset. <laughs> yeah. Big part of it. I'm like tunnel vision on this goal of mine to establish myself as a serious fucking bodybuilder that inspires people to stay natural and stay consistent control the variables and do not fucking know your potential unless you try don't know if you saw my before pictures i could have easily said oh you got booty ass genetics kid like do a physique rating on that right now in your head tell me if you think that he is gonna get his natural fucking pro bar let's go Come on, baby. Let's go. <laughs> hit the three plates for me because I, I can't hit that shit right now. Weak as hell. <laughs> yep. Feel it. Control it. All you, baby. Uh, yes, sir. Yep. 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 Uh, Where are we going? Huh? Right here. Yep. Uh, Push it. Come on. Down up, baby. Light. 
Thumbs up, baby. How many was that? I, I lost count. Like After five, I lose count. Yeah. This one's like, you can't, you can't miss with this one. I was watching, I think it was Jay Cutler, talk about how he used to hit it. And ever since I watched that video, I started to do like super slow, not like uh, momentum, yeah. bringing it up momentum, just yeah. keep it here, just, just use your muscle like the whole time. And ever since I started doing that on this machine, bro, crazy ass bumps. Flex the weight up. That's what helped me. I forgot who said that. You can pop your pecs, you can feel it in the right place. And plus, pretty common sense, you want your muscles to be doing the work. You don't want momentum to be in the equation at all. Oh cool, lots of weight, but like not lots of tearing. Yeah. And it's like one thing when I first started working out, bro, my form was garbage. Just momentum everything. I mean like you chest, were. squat. Yeah. Now that I'm doing this, it's just like nah, like how you do it, it's just like Convicted serial killer Richard Ramirez seemed to relish the concept of evil. Once upon a time, a lot of folks in the state of California I think you got four. Let's fucking do it, man. Gotta be the fucking same. Come on. <laughs> you trying to get that gym satisfied? Oh, fuck it, man. Uh, going. It's close enough. They got me fucking after two, after two hours, I felt that shit. <laughs> uh, see, I would have not came in this bitch and had this as good of a chest workout 16 days out. He was like, Bro, I don't want to get in like the way of your. I was like, nah, no. come through. I need that chest. <laughs> I need it. From Louisiana, I, like leave like tomorrow or something. I'm like, dude, I have. Oh, to you're sit. not from here. No. No shit. You're like, that's yeah, badass. Yeah. The refinery is the gym to go to. Oh, go bro. To yeah, I met him a couple of days ago, and he was like, Max is around here, right? And I was like, yeah. Yeah. I was like, I'm like, I just want to say what's up. Oh, what's good, bro? Yeah. 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 Good, man. That's good, dude. Nice good to, to see you. Yeah. yeah. I was trying to say hi, and I was like, Max Taylor. I knew Max Taylor was here. And he said Shizzy was coming tomorrow. I was like, no fucking way. I was like, I'm gonna see what's up. I wanna see if they're both free. And I saw I was like, bro. That, yeah, that's what's up. Place. Like right now, it's like some straight up like slowed yeet and shit, uh, and like whatever uh, SoundCloud's got for me, honestly. Uh, yeah, like you know, I was just throwing some random like random artists that have some bangers. Like you never know. This picture of this girl with her cat, red hair, like some edgy <laughs> shit, like some edgy shit. But like I like it. Suffocation, like but the song, intro is like heavenly. That. No, that's, the song's care. great. Yeah, the song's great. <laughs> oh, I still like, I need an emo ghost. bitch like this, dog. Like, she's hot. I like that. <laughs> I love all that, like, pastel ghosts, like, slow reverb fucking. Oh, I love yeah. that stuff. I'll listen to slow reverb, a little peep, and get a good yeah, pop. Yeah, bro. I'm going to put on some slow little peep right now. I'm <laughs> yeah, it's all yours. Oh, I got you. Yep. Feel it. Control it. You went there, baby. Oh, oh. You can see, like, you have like two chests through your shirt when you do that. You can see your upper chest separation. Oh, bro, what the fuck? <laughs> Bro's upper chest dominant. Pump it up. It's the boy. Hey, you got a guts tattoo, don't you? Guts? Yeah. Uh, I'm marked. Did you show your tattoo on the... Nah, you Let me show. Because we all got that guts on us. That guts on us. Oh, I'm yeah. going to show the We've back We've been one. getting inked up. Oh, that shit is crazy. 
four months ago, I had no tattoos. Yeah, now just, I'm. Drew, eat, speed the, <laughs> eat the fuck <laughs> up. <laughs> Yo, so what's the fit, bro? Tell me the fit, man. Oh shit. Oh yeah. The Cargos. Solomons. Oh shit. Yeah, yeah, come yeah. up. Got the Go Young up. LA Cargos. Oh drippy. I yeah, did a sleepwear from Young LA. I yeah, think they stopped crazy. selling them, but yeah. super comfy. Yeah. Yeah, that's why I want them to make more gym clothes, cause it's like this stuff is comfy, bro. Yeah. This this stringer. Mm -hmm. Look at that. It's comfy as fuck. You yeah, see you my titty? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you got back, dude. <laughs> I love you, Mom. Wait, what was your first tattoo you got? This one, the sword with the the heart and the drums on drumsticks. Oh, that's hard. Yeah, so I got like every note for my family. The drumsticks, because I love playing drums. Fire. Uh, I don't play an instrument. That's sick. Yeah, I, I, I have one in my house and everything. I, I kind of want to. That'd be a cool goal to set for myself. Mm -hmm. Like learn an instrument. Yeah. Shizzy in piano. a band. Dude, just fucking. <laughs> that's sick. I want to learn the guitar. Bro, that's one of those instruments. Like, it's just so. Like it's no homo beautiful. shit, just like sexy as fuck, bro. Like, yeah. Just play riff and shit, like. Bro, if you're yeah, if you're a six out of ten, you know, yeah, you're automatic instant, eight out of ten instantly. And then if you can sing, oh. 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 What did they call it? They're like, they're ugly hot. You could be like all dressed nice, whip a guitar and sing, you're a 10 out of 10. Yeah. They don't matter how fucked up your teeth are. <laughs> Bro, imagine, imagine seeing <laughs> Shizzy, like, you pull up to the to the fucking function. That's Shizzy's that. over there with his guitar, <laughs> singing a song. Now that's <laughs> angelic ass voice. Like. That's max prestige level shit. <laughs> you have muscles and can sing and shit. You're probably a serial killer if you can do no, all yeah, that. But, uh, you're, you're American psycho at that point. You got something in your basement. Check that dude's hard drives. <laughs> We're going to Hawaii after the natural show out in California. I haven't been on a vacation God knows how long. But we're gonna get a vlog and I wanna do a cheat day out there. We oh, do like a yes. cheat day thing. It's good ass food out there, like, oh, 100%. come on bro. I'll be excited to have a break. Hopefully I have that Natty Pro card in my back pocket. Kick my feet up, relax a little bit, you know? Oh, yeah, yeah, come on, give me three. Give me three. Get that up, get it up, come on, come on. Finish it! Finish that shit! Uh, let's go! That's good shit right there! Yes, sir. Thank you, thank you. Is this real? Chat, chat. Is this real? <laughs> Is this fucking real? Hey, Drew, sure, man. dude. Nice to meet you. Fucking huge! Jeez, dude. Yeah. Yeah. Shizzy? Yeah. yeah. Alright. Yeah. God damn, dude. You great look, dude. You look, you look great too, man. Thank you. Jack Hanma. Yeah. I'm, at, I'm at Butler Pro Gym yesterday and this kid comes out. He's like, dude, you're on me, man. I saw you in Max Taylor's no, video. Shit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, dude. Yeah. God damn. Wow, bro. Man, you're looking insane. Dude, dude, come from so this guy, that's like, that's a huge accomplishment. No, dude, I walked down here earlier and Charles was like, look at this guy. I was like, jeez. He's, he's natural. That's insane. Yeah, that insane. Is. Yeah. It's time for biceps, baby. Yeah, Shizzy hit and tries. He hit biceps yesterday. Cable curl. We hit this last time, right? Yeah. Straight bar. Straight failure. biceps now we found this bad boy this the is crucifix of biceps this is this the one you were using yes bro i'm saying he came to my house and was like there's this preacher curl machine you can load yeah. it heavier on the shits right here <laughs> and i was like yeah dude i had I like this stacked yes. at the end and just like right like this is easy 
but like right when yeah. you hit at the peak, bro, I was just it like. Makes sense because everyone has different genetics, different yep. insertions, and like where shit needs tension. So it's pretty cool. Later, dude. <laughs> Later, motherfucker. No. <laughs> If I did hop on, and it would be interesting. No, oh, because like, what no, level would I be able to go to? If I see with guys like Marcus fit and shit. And I don't know how you make him look. Fuck. Yeah, he's yeah. big, but for some reason you just yeah. look bigger than. That's crazy. Sorry, Marcus, but yeah. <laughs> no, it is what it is. <laughs> you know, I always talk shit to him. <laughs> right, Marcus. Fit? Yeah, Marcus yeah. fit. Yeah. He's an IPB pro. Yeah, like, he's, he's, he's like, big as shit. Oh, he's like yeah, yeah. It's just, it's just like until I'm like my 30s, like 32, 32. If I'm if I'm still in this and I want to go to a different level. I'll think about it. But yeah. for right now, I want to promote like natural bodybuilding. Yeah. Like I just want to tell kids that you can do this shit. The whole fitness world's fucked in that sense, yeah. bro. Yeah. They're like, we like we know so many 17, 18 year old kids that are like running tons just of Just straight, like crazy. Even SARMs shit. is terrible, bro. Like kids think SARMs are safer. Like, oh let me take Rad 140. I have a buddy that took it, his test levels dropped to 14. Like what like nah. SARMs are just as bad. They're steroids with less research. Yeah. That's really and it's awesome. like we went through the the shitty and the like experimenting and all the tough shit. We can supply the knowledge to the people because everyone else wanted a quick way out and they just exactly. slammed roids. But we went through it, natty, controlling what we could control, experimenting. Motherfucker, I talked about how many programs I've ran and shit, but like there's not enough people promoting that anymore. So I feel that. I'm because in the same boat. Younger influence. 20 21 year olds that look good because they're running gear and they're like this is my cycle this is sick like i feel great yeah. like blood works great well then even the natural <laughs> one <laughs> the natural people they're trying to play catch up yeah. but then they sacrifice feeling good to look a certain way and yeah. it's it ends up being super unhealthy and it's like we need to promote health being training. healthy and strong and fucking feeling great like, they need to just make a safe steroid already like <laughs> For everyone, just like everyone, <laughs> everyone be swole, dude. When I'm not, I'm more worried about long term too, cause like after that 50 mark, that's your, another half of your life. I don't want to yeah. think like, oh, I'm 50 and I have 10 more years, cause I took a no shit shot. ton of gear. <laughs> 